Well, it's about that time. The majority of parents and students are getting ready for school. And with a new leader, how is the San Antonio Independent School District planning to raise test scores and lower the dropout rate? Darlene Dorsey spoke with the superintendent and joins us live near downtown with hopefully some answers. Darlene. Yes, yeah, since the superintendent decided to make a part-time assignment a full-time mission with the test scores up and the graduation rate up, we asked him, how do you keep things moving in the right direction? Position very serious. Dr. Sylvester Perez knows parents in the San Antonio School District area have options like private or charter schools, and he offers advice to people who think SAISD doesn't have the best education. Do some investigating on your own. Don't listen to the hearsay. We have great kids and we have wonderful staff here. Pitt has moved back to his hometown to retire, but he has spent the last year as interim superintendent. And after the school board's failed attempts to replace him, Pitt has agreed to stay on the job. So no, I did not pursue this position, but uh, after all that was said and done, ultimately uh, this was a great opportunity for me. And he hopes it'll be a good thing for students. He admits there's been too much focus on test scores. His focus is on well-rounded students, learning languages, arts, and some creative thinking. The graduation rate has increased from about 60% in 2007 to 82% last year. The superintendent knows business and city leaders are watching. We are very important to the economic engine, indeed the future of San Antonio, and I understand that. He says the turnover rate for teachers is low, and Perez wants to find inspiring ways to raise the bar for educators and students. No pep talk. He calls it a game plan. We're going to take this one game at a time, and I'm going to take this one day at a time. Uh, there are no guarantees in life. Now, the superintendent's salary pays more than $280,000 annually, but he says what matters most right now is an opportunity to improve the quality of education. Darlene Dorsey, News 4, San Antonio. All right.